So I'm going to import the random variable. Then I'm going to welcome the user. Okay, so I've got to generate the random number. Uh, I'm going to go int secret equals random dot rand int one and ten. So I'm using that random module with the rand int random integer generator to generate a number between one and ten, assigning it to int secret, which is the secret number. int guesses equals zero, because they've guessed zero times so far. So now I am going to use a while true here. And the reason I'm going to use while true is because I'm going to use a break to break out of that loop when the user either wins or they guess three times. So it'll just go forever unless I fix that. So ask the user for their guess, int user equals int input. Now remember that I have to change this to an integer because I'm, using, I'm gonna compare it to an integer up here. So enter a number between 1 and 10. And I'm going to go ahead and strip that input to make sure there's no white space in case they add white space. Converting it to an integer will probably take care of that anyway, but can't be too safe. Okay, so there's that. Now I have to see if they guess right. So I'm going to say if int user equals int secret, then they won. Print you won the secret number was int secret. Okay, and then I'm going to break that loop because that's the end of the game if they win. Okay, and now if they guess wrong, which would be the else, notice I'm, I'm keeping my things nice and lined up, even my comments. So I like to indent my comments because having code that looks like this I think it's hard to read. So I always indent my comments to the level of the code block that they're a part of. So they guess wrong. And then I'm going to increment the number of guesses. Int guesses plus equals one. Because <coughs> they used up a guess. And now if I'm gonna tell them that they were wrong, print Int, let's see, int user is not the secret number. And now if guesses equals three, if int guesses equals three, they've used up all their guesses. What am I doing with these curly braces? Wrong language, there we go. All right, if they've used all their guesses, then I'm gonna say print, you are out of guesses. And that's the game over, break. So I'm gonna break out of the loop there. And then print, thank you for playing my game. 
I'm also going to tell them what the secret number was F if they if they lose. So F the secret number was in secret. Okay, so this is the whole program. We've got a while loop and an if else and then another if right in here. This doesn't need an else because if int guesses wasn't three, we don't do anything. Let's run this and see how it, how it looks. Welcome to my guessing game. In our number between one and 10, enter one. One is not the secret number. Two, two is not the secret number. Three is not the secret number. You're out of guesses, the secret number was 10. Thanks for playing my game. Okay, so now I have a game where I can guess multiple times. 